Eco Odor Free Acrylic System. Just like any acrylic system, it is very important to get the correct liquid to powder ratio. This will ensure that you get the best bond to the natural nail and the strongest acrylic application. To achieve this, fully immerse your brush in the Eco Odor Free Liquid. Release any air bubbles that are trapped in the hairs. Then slide your brush against the dappen dish, the entire length of the hairs to pull off the liquid. Then flip your brush and slide only half the brush from the ferrule up to the middle. What you've done is left the liquid on only one side of the brush and near the tip of the brush. Now it's time to go into your powder. Dip your brush into the powder with the tip that now holds the right amount of liquid. To get that right amount of powder, you're going to stay in there longer than you would for traditional monomer. Depending on the size of your brush and the amount of liquid in the hairs, you could be in the powder anywhere from 8 to 15 seconds. You will know you have the right consistency as you place your ball on the form of the nail. It should hold its shape and leave a little dimple where your brush was. It should be glossy and shiny but not immediately self-level. If it immediately levels, then you've applied it too wet and should stay in the powder longer. If it holds its shape but has a lot of loose powder on it, then it is too dry and you should stay in the powder less time. With practice, you will be able to see that your consistency is right or wrong before you've even begin to pat your acrylic into place. Here is a ball that is perfect. Here is a ball that is too dry. Here is a ball that is too wet. For this demonstration, we are using a revelation tip. Be sure and follow the steps in sanitation and prep before proceeding to this application. First, apply a ball of ecosystem odor-free acrylic to the revelation tip. Once you drop your ball, it is important to wipe your brush on a paper towel to clean the hairs. This will prevent the product from sticking to your brush as you spread the ball. Use your brush to perfect the shape of your ecosystem odor-free acrylic. Remember your ecosystem odor-free acrylic will not cure until it goes into the UV light. So take the time to perfect your work with your brush and save time to finish filing later. Once everything is applied, it is time to cure your nail for three minutes in a UV 9 watt light. Be advised, your client might feel a warming sensation otherwise known as an exothermic reaction as the product cures within the first 30 seconds. Be sure to tell your client if it gets too hot, just take your hand out of the light for a few seconds and it will stop immediately. Once your nail is comfortable again, you can put it back in the light. If you sculpt, you will need to remove the form and cure the underside of the nail. This is only necessary if you are sculpting with white powder. Place the nails back in the light for an additional three minutes. When the nail is cured, it will have a slight tacky layer to it. This is very quick and easy to remove with a 180 grit file. Simply work from the right to left and gently roll the sticky layer off. The sticky layer makes the dust fall onto your table, which helps to prevent inhaling the dust. Once the sticky layer is gone, you can use your 180 grit file to fix any imperfections in your application as well as shape your sidewalls and free edge. Finish filing over the nail with a buffer block or file buffer and you're ready for your clear coat. Capping sealer in cuticle oil finish off the odor-free acrylic just